Hi guys, hi guys, hi guys, hi guys, hi. I think that might be my little song. see you there yeah I did let's get into it my name is Michaela and I'm here to tell you you can do it let's get in to the video I'm having too much fun. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Hope you didn't miss me. Hope you didn't. Hope you hope you hope you hope you hope you hope you didn't. Yeah, welcome back to my channel again guys. Thank you so much for the love on the other video. I really, 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 really 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 appreciate the love <laughs> that everybody um has shown off of that video i really do appreciate it uh, let's get into the video as you can see i'm in a different setting because fun fact i was not actually at my home this is home now right before we get into the rest of this video this is just a quick disclaimer that my eyelash did want to be the star of this video unfortunately however i'd noticed this a bit too late um so please don't come for me um me and my eyelash are working some things out um in light of our future videos but yeah that's enough from me um and let's get into it guys um so yeah so in this video we will be talking about not giving up what did i say not giving up what did i say not giving up not giving up um i am a person when i can't do something fam don't don't come and tell me anything else like don't come and tell me anything if i can't do it the first time i'm not gonna attempt the next and that's not a good attitude to have so in this video we're going to be discussing just this so one of the first reasons why i'd say that you should not give up on you you should not give up on your idea is because you don't know who you're gonna bless you know not giving up through your perseverance you don't know who you're going to bless if you have um you know that business idea do not give up because in the long run you don't know who that is going to impact you don't know whose life that is going to bless in the long in the in the long what how in the in the long run that's what i was supposed to say you don't know who that is going to bless so that is one of the reasons why i'd say that you should not give up it's important to know that you are you for a reason God made you for a reason. God didn't say, I want Jerry to be like Tom. Tom is going to be exactly identical. I want clothes. He didn't do that. No, no. You are you for a reason. And it's so important for you to embrace that. Now me, sometimes I definitely, definitely struggle to, you know, um, be um, authentically myself airing myself to other people oh you don't look like this and you don't look like that look like this but you're not a kid cat or when but you don't look like a pen but you look like sure but sure is a self raw okay yeah um <laughs> but sometimes i do struggle to um you know really really be in a place where i'm really loving myself but it's so important um i believe that god fearfully and wonderfully made me a tip i'd say on actually believing in yourself and liking and loving yourself is to not focus on 
the negatives do not focus on the negatives um of yourself so when you wake up you look at yourself you say i'm sweet you look up you say whoa <laughs> you say whoa that nose that nose that eyelash jesus made that eyelash and you made it to be long and sweet and you made it to be extravagant and you made my teeth you made that to be what it is so just embracing everything about yourself speak encouraging words over yourself so everything you think you're not um go against that anything to encourage yourself say that over yourself and repeatedly say that over yourself we live in a society that makes so many standards in terms of beauty and style and all of that now i'm not saying don't like fashion and go and walk around with plastic bottle as ear that and if you want to wear a plastic bottle as an earring that's you i don't mind i just say embrace who you are embrace yourself don't let anybody tell you you are not enough or you have to be like this or you have to be like that embrace who god created you to be can i get a hey hey man yeah so yeah, don't let anybody tell you you are not good enough and that you don't fit up to a certain standard. You fit to the Lord's standard, okay? I'll tell you guys a little story. I do a, a lot of this with my hands and I think I'm looking to... Am I, I hope I'm looking into the right camera because if I'm not... I'll tell you guys a little story. So there was one time... I was on my way to um, Westfield to meet a friend of mine and there was this girl now <laughs> it's kind of a funny story now I was in a rush to catch this train right so before <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry okay yeah <laughs> okay before I left the house I had managed to moisturize my hands I had managed to moisturize my arms but I feel like everybody has fallen into this where they don't moisturize their legs and, and you know their ankles and i was i was running a bit late so i didn't manage to do that and i left my moisturizer that i usually put in my bag at home so I'm running 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 I get on the train now my hair's kind of a mess i don't i don't really look the way i want to look my hands are dry all of that stuff and i got to the station and there was this girl she was sitting down she was quite pretty i'm not gonna lie she was pretty and um i'm not saying that I'm not, but anyways um she was quite pretty um and she was on the phone and obviously i've noticed now that my ankles are dry i'm gonna link this story to what i'm trying to say so she was on the phone and i looked up and i just saw her looking at my my ankles like And I'm, I'm so sure she was like on FaceTime. Now, bear in mind, my ankles weren't that dry. Like, it wasn't, it wasn't really not that deep. It's not like they were gray. But like, but like, yeah, I'm so sure she was on FaceTime. So she may have been showing this person as well. So that really brought my whole mood down. In my head, I haven't, I'm not, I, I automatically just started comparing myself. Oh. I don't have makeup on. I don't have the makeup look that I wanted to go for to uh, go for today. <laughs> My ankles are dry. <laughs> I don't have cream. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I need to stop laughing, but it really, really, really put down my mood for like majority of the whole day. And I say that to say that you shouldn't let people's opinions dictate how you feel about yourself. Yes, you know dry ankles but it only matter it only lasts for a, a, a season you know you can always go to the shop and cream your ankles come on everybody is gonna have something to say about you but that's not for you to then fall into the trap of actually believing those things and you should take advice from people guys if you're walking around with dry ankles please let's 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 come together to to fix that 
you know don't allow people's perceptions of you negative perceptions of you to be internalized within you because you are smart you're intelligent you're beautiful you're handsome whoever is watching this whoever is watching this you're beautiful you are enough so don't let society tell you that you are not enough yeah, thank you guys for joining my channel today um it's quite a short one it's not pretty long um but yeah don't forget to like comment subscribe i see i see where of you there and you're not subscribing Bye. <laughs> i'm joking don't forget to like comment subscribe and i will see you in the next video. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm I'm wiping my face with tomatoes.